My name's Charlotte Penny. I work at the Arts Council England in the music team and we have been supporters of Independent Venue Week for the last few years um, through the National Lottery Programme Project Grants. Over the last few years we've we've demonstrated how we've recognised the importance of grassroots music venues um, in the music scene um, in the UK. We've, we've had a, a specific part of our grants programme called the Grassroots Music Fund. Um, we've had that for the last two years and we're going to continue that going forward. Um, it, they really are the bedrock of supporting new talent um, in England um, and that's our particular uh, interest in supporting the um, venues. What we've seen over the pandemic and how the venues have suffered, the, the issues that were before the, band, the pandemic are still there. There's still leaky roofs, there's still substandard uh, sound system, lighting system access issues. Those issues are still there. They're now accompanied by staffing issues, by getting venues back on their feet. Um, and re-engaging with audiences. But at the same time, there's been some really positive things that have happened. There's been some great digital work, there's been live streaming, um, and all, uh, venues working with the communities around those venues. And that's a particular part of Independent Venue Week and their year-round work that we're interested in, how those venues can work with those communities. So although there's a huge amount of negatives, there's been some great positives that we want to cling on to. Yeah.